Hello friends and welcome to YouTube channel Freedom Tech and in this session what we are going to learn in this session we are going to create uh, another text to speech engine okay I have already made the video how to create text to speech engine on Raspberry Pi 4 using Google text to speech service okay and today video we are going to use here our Python module to create a text to speech engine okay friends so but before we move to our practical friends if you learn something from our videos please consider to subscribe our channel okay friends let's start and thank you so first just open the terminal okay friends and we are going to install here a python module so the module name is gtts simply run the command sudo pip3 install gtts that's it it will install gtts module on our raspberry pi 4 okay i have already installed sudo pip3 install gtts and then just hit enter okay friends so now friends a gtts module is basically create the mp3 file okay and we need here for playing that mp3 file we need here a mpg321 player so we are going to install that player also so run command like this so friends sudo apt install mpg321 and hit enter install sorry install yes like this way so sudo apt install mpg321 and it will install mpg321 on our raspberry pi 4 friends okay so we have our gtts module we have successfully installed also mpg321 player so we are ready and i am going to make just clear the screen and open any python editor I am going to open here a Sony Python ID. Okay, you can use a visual code also. Okay, so simply open Python editor and create the new file. I have created a freedomtech.py. Okay, you can mention any name. So we are ready and we are going to import here our module. So first GTTS module. So from GTTS import GTTS. That's it. We have import the module. Also, friends, as I told you. Uh, gtts create the audio.mp3 file and playing the file we need here a mpg321 uh, module or mpg not module mpg321 player okay friends also mpg321 is basically the system command and we need to uh, run the system command on python we need here a import os module OS module so simply import that module import OS and it will uh, it will run the system commands with our uh, Python okay friends it is simple now we are going to create our function so let's start we are going to define a speak function diff def speak then inside that audio string okay friends then we are going to use create uh, we are going to not use we are going to create a variable again you can mention any variable friends okay friends so gts is equal to and i am going to mention gtts gtts is our module okay so gtts bracket text is equal to we are going to mention audio string okay the audio string so let's mention the audio string here audio string friends and then we are going to mention the language so language is equal to of course we are going to use here our english language okay so tts is equal to gtts module text audio string and language english that's it friends now we are going to uh, use the tts variable so tts dot save what we are going to save as i told you we are going to save a file a audio dot mp3 file mention the name audio dot mp3 you can mention audio 1 dot mp3 audio 2 dot mp3 any name okay but extension is dot mp3 friends and double quote okay write this way so tts dot save bracket double quote audio dot mp3 okay friends the name of the mp3 file then we are going to use our os dot system for 
running the file audio data mp3 file so like this way mpg321 audio dot mp3 that's it okay now we are ready and uh, we have successfully created our function now we are going to use that function friends okay so simply speak inside that we are going to mention some text like this way hello world and just run the code hello world that's it friends as you can see we have successfully create our a speak function okay friends so like this way if you want to mention a uh, input so we are going to mention that method also a is equal to input inside that type text like this way and here we are going to call the a and play the code hello all hello all that's it friends we have successfully create our another text to speech engine okay friends so i hope you will learn something from this video in next video we are going to uh, use this function for our wikipedia okay so we will meet our next video till then thank you take care and bye bye